Joanna Lumley was made a dame by Queen Elizabeth for services to drama, entertainment and charitable causes. The absolutely fabulous actress, who is best known for her role as Patsy Stone in the former sitcom, has also made a name for herself as a campaigner as she fights the rights of Gurkhas to settle in the UK among numerous environmental schemes. Speaking of her latest achievement, Joanna shared her appreciation on Radio 2's The Zoe Ball Show on Wednesday. When radio presenter Zoe Ball asked what Joanna's initial reaction was upon hearing about being made a dame, she replied saying she had known about the honor weeks before it was announced. I was on my own because my husband was working up in Birmingham, she said. When I opened the letter, it was in December, Joanna added before coming to an abrupt pause. I burst into tears. It was such a shock because my whole life I was so thrilled I had an OBE and I thought it was fabulous. The actress continued, I thought that was just as much as a person could ever want. So, I thought, A, there must be a mistake. B, it was just overwhelming. Now I'm completely unbearable, I must just warn you. Joanne equipped. Elsewhere, last month, the Falling for Figaro star made headlines when she said that people were jumping on the mental illness bandwagon as she encouraged them to have a stiff upper lip. The No Room for Secrets author declared that there was a distinct difference between those who struggle with emotions such as grief compared to those who are properly clinically depressed. The discussion arose during Joanna's appearance on GB News last month when TV presenter Isabel Oakshot asked about the many mental health charities the 75-year-old is currently working with. I have to say, this is a horrible thing to say, but I think the mental health thing is being overplayed at the moment because anybody who is even remotely sad says they have got mental problems, Joanna expressed. Dot you go, this is what is called being human. When someone dies and you grieve, that's human. That's what being a human is. You're not mentally ill. Joanna argued that people jumping on a mental illness bandwagon were ultimately belittling those who were seriously struggling with the health condition. TV journalist Piers Morgan appeared to agree with Joanna as he took to Twitter to shed light on the sensitive matter. The former Good Morning Britain co-host joked that when he makes a comment similar to Joanna's, he is branded a heartless monster. Perhaps now a national treasure like Dame Joanna said it, people may understand it's actually a good thing to show mental resilience and a bit of stiff upper lip. He tweeted in views of his 7. 9 million followers. Joanna released her latest book, titled A Queen for All Seasons, in October 2021. It highlights all of Her Majesty's greatest accomplishments since acquiring the throne in 1952, having gone on to become the world's longest reigning monarch with a whopping 70 years in power.